this is gonna be our final stream for Subnautica. Johnny Discography acquired Tob. Umbasa. Umbasa. All right, my dudes. Let's get into the game. Now, let me show you where we're at. For those of you who have stuck with me for this journey, you'll be very familiar with this area. Which is, of course, the Crystal Caves, right? So Crystal Caves, this horrible, tight area with a big, nasty leviathan that loves to grab us. But it's okay. It's okay. We have ways to protect against him because I found a zap module for the truck. So if we get grabbed, or when we get grabbed, we can zap him. And that should protect us. Furthermore, like I said, I, I found the three artifact blueprints, as you can see on the top right. I'll remove my face temporarily so you can see that. And I've brought the mats to build them as well, guys. Okay? So we're fucking ready, right? We're ready. We're ready. Let's jump in. Okay. Our truck is now uh, massive. As you can see, we have all the wagons. All the wagons. Finally acquired this sexy background music to kickstart my career as a porn actor. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I mean... Some tracks, I, I could see it. You know? I, I, I could see you using some tracks in that way. Paul, welcome back, man. What's up? How you doing, bro? By the way, Paul, are you, uh, did you look into what PC you were gonna get? I don't know if you were gonna do that, like, now or later on. What, what was the dealio with that? Feeling cozy, nice, dude. Yeah, that pic you posted was very cozy. With the coffee mug. Okay, so this is the entrance to the caves, right? That we know and hate. We have the prawn with us. And we can go as deep down as we have to. Because last time in Dragon Ball Z, we picked up all the depth module upgrades. Okay, so... Uh, somewhere in here... We found... Uh, an entrance to a deeper... Biome. Uh... Scylla, very... Scylla, do you see that? Would that qualify as a tentacle? I don't know. Uh, but we're going very deep. Very close to the thousand meter limit. And... We just have to find, once again, the entrance to that deeper biome. Which is um, a bit tricky to find because, you know, again, this cave is just a disaster, right? So, I think we're gonna get grabbed. Okay. What? Oh, there we go. Zap him. Alright. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, we're getting eaten. And, yes, I think this was the landmark. Those three plants. I believe if we keep going here, we'll find it eventually. What's the difference between a prawn and a shrimp? Uh, you know, I've wondered that myself. I think that shrimps are smaller and prawns are, like, bigger. But I'm not 100% on that one. It could also just be a regional thing, like... <clears throat> Like, uh, for example, maybe I think in Australia you say shrimp. Okay. The crystals in this environment are confusing my senses. And yet I feel certain there is something important below. Mm. A facility or a body component. Perhaps okay. both. I cannot okay. tell. Okay, very useful, Alan. 
thank you for that. And let's equip our repair tool. Well, we probably need to... Okay. We're being screamed at. Okay, okay. Go away. Go away. Right? Away with you. My god. This whole area is a nightmare. It's so friggin' hard to find anything. Let's keep heading, like, east. I think it was towards the east, basically. Let's do that. Spaniard, man! Welcome back! Bro, thanks for the tier one. Really appreciate that shit. This is it, guys. You see this? Okay, this was the landmark. This is the beginning of that deeper biome. And as we go in here, let's take a moment to pray to our gods and repair the chub. Spaniard, how you been, man? How's the new job going and all that? Entering square lands. To imagine if it just just actually turns into Minecraft. <laughs> Also, notice how Tob said evolving into Minecraft. You, uh... Man, you really like Minecraft, huh? <laughs> we'll, we'll just say that. We'll just say that. These crystals look pretty dope, though. Oh! There's another? Come get me, bro. I am fucking ready. You don't understand. My prepar my level of preparation is so powerful. It's unlike anything you've ever seen. In fact, I'm so confident of a substantial facility that unable to identify. I'm gonna drive directly into him. Or like, not even gonna avoid him. Get zapped. Get easily zapped. Whoa! That sound scared me, dude. Okay, we have a big gamble as well. Oh! Okay. Just don't get eaten. While on the outside, and we've done it. Fabricator to build each component, we can assemble them. And then we can transfer you out of my head? I am anticipating it as much as you are. Okay. So we have a big gamble real quick. Let's go to it. Dramatic drums. Spaniard with his chance to win and show Tob. You know, if he can roll a double six, guys, right? And it's pro it's proven to be very difficult. You go. I'll give you my best roll, okay? We'll give you a very good roll here. Oh, oh dude. That was tight. A four and a six. Very difficult for some, at least. God damn it, Tom. That was very close, Spaniard. Paul says, I buy, I buy power has a Memorial Day sale going on now. Nice. I buy power seems to be pretty decent. Whoa. Never go to Vegas. It, it was so funny. It stuck with me what Tom said the other day, like, dude, don't go to Vegas, Johnny, or at least don't play dice because you're the worst dice roller. 
Okay, so I think here is where we build the, the different artifacts. So, Alan, you said your people came here in search of a cure? All of these packs are like foreign language. You were a scientist? So, um, by the way, Paul, my scientific contributions feel free to post the specs in the, in the Discord. Said, like me. If that is your interpretation. So, how did your valuable scientific mind wind up infected? And we'll take a look, man. We'll help you out. My body. Perhaps you should build the next component. Okay. That's his body. So you came here to search for a cure? I led the mission. Does that mean the bacteria got out on your watch? This subject is uncomfortable. If you would like to know more, I will ask that you first construct the final component. Yeah, I wouldn't get an AMD GPU. I would not get an AMD. Uh, CPUs are fine. Ryzen are, are, can be great, but uh, GPUs are this is the last not worth it. Soon I will IMO. Again. What will you do with your newfound freedom? I must return home to make amends. Amends? For the bacterium? There seems to be a lot you're not telling me. It is hard for me to find the words. I must collect my thoughts. We have all the necessary components. You may initiate body fabrication sequence from the terminal. You still owe me an explanation. I understand. Shit, dude. It's happening. Commencing storage medium fabrication. The escape of the bacterial was an accident. I thought my solution was foolproof. I was wrong. Did you cause the accident? Yes. Boss music starts. I do not wish to speak about it. We can come back to this. Yeah, Scylla, we're making a body for him so he can get out of our consciousness and be stored in that body. Whoa, that looks dope, actually. Shit. Okay. Hey, buddy. See, you're, you're going for the quad legs model. Commencing the transfer. Distinct lack of tentacles detected, right? Did it work? Are we... Unlike my album cover, which does feature tentacles, Scylla. I hope you appreciated that. It's been that. Some time since I last stretched out in so many dimensions. Like waking from a dream. Okay, that's pretty dope. Whoa. He's the Dr. Octavian from... Hey. From the alien race. Shameless plug. Oh, yeah. Really very, very shameless. There are some remnants. Would you like your memories of me removed as well? I feel like I shameless describes me very what? well. You still owe me the end of your story. I actually have I no shame. Return home to assess, repair, make amends. Tell me more. Tell me more about this. Alan. When the bacteria escaped, it was my fault. I disobeyed the directive from my network. You can't romance him, Scylla. Okay? Oh, no. We noticed that a species of Leviathan young produced an enzyme that is efficient against the bacteria. I thought if we incubated sea dragon eggs, we might expedite their hatching. I was not wrong. But... It would appear that sea dragon parents are stronger and more motivated than our facility was rated to handle. And the bacteria got out, infecting everything. How many survived the outbreak back home? Are they still waiting for someone to bring back a cure? I do not know. Can I help? The fact that I withheld this information does not concern you. It was certainly manipulative. But I've also made my own share of mistakes. I'm still committed to helping. I accept your help. Find me at the gate when you are ready. In the meantime, I must prepare. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Hmm.
phase gate facility. Okay. Please, I will join you in the gate base when everything is ready. But for now, I have much to prepare. Just seems natural. <laughs> You're like, oh, hey, Alan, how you doing? Did you have a hard day at work? Nice tentacles you got there, Alan. One of your uncle's name is Alan? You gotta eat something as well. Okay. So we gotta get out of here. Hopefully the way out is less confusing than the way in. Hey buddy, who's a good leviathan? Who's the best leviathan in the world? It, it's a pretty disgusting one. It's, it's kind of like a, a swimming centipede, isn't it? Fuck off. The good part about being grabbed so many times in this game is that I'm no longer afraid of it. <laughs> I've outgrown my fear. I've overcome my fear. It's nightmare feel, it is. Yeah. It's just a tail. Yeah, it doesn't really qualify, right? It's pretty nasty too. The, the way like when it hugs you, you can see his mouth hole. It's like, come on guys, come on. Was that necessary? Okay, let's remove the blueprints. From there. I don't need them anymore. You're suffering with AMD. Yeah, I, I had an AMD as well. A GPU, that is. And had a lot of driver issues. It was an older one, but, you know, still. They still have a lot to... To work on. This will be my first gaming PC pop in the chair. Dude, very exciting. Very exciting. Yeah, definitely reach out for help, man. Because PC gaming... You know, it's easy until something's not working. And then, uh... <laughs> reach out for help. How's everybody's week going, by the way? Wednesday, of course. The midway point. Where we, we like to check in and see how everybody's doing. What is the way out of here? Hmm. Okay. This looks promising. Oh. The levee's there. It is going up this way, huh? Chase his butt down. Anybody in chat playing Biomutant? Started playing yesterday. And I'm doing two different characters. One for... Just when we're hanging out in the Discord. And we're gonna start a new character on Saturday for stream. So the offline character is a Deadeye. Range, just pure ranged with rifles. Like, non-automatic rifles. And just going for luck and crit. And all that greedy goodness. I got a decent chunk in. Midday got sidetracked, so now I'm level 14. And I haven't attacked the first settlement yet. Oh, shit. <laughs> Dude, I've already done, like, one settlement and a few missions. And I'm still level 8 or something. Found a few level 30 weapons. Yeah, those are level gated, right? So you can't wear them until you get like Borderlands or that kind of thing. 
But uh, early impressions for me are pretty positive. Of course, it is very early in the content, so I, I, I expect it will, it will not, you know, it will burn out at some point for me, like many of these open world games. But so far, I'm enjoying it a lot. I think the the little raccoons are adorable. And it looks great for a game of that budget, to be honest. So I was saying, the other character, the one we're gonna do on stream, is it's gonna be a like a, a how how would you say this? Like a goody two shoes melee, dual wielding size. Size are the little forks, if you guys know Raffaello from from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. That's kind of what I'm going for. It's going to be a red raccoon with size and just melee focus, mercenary class. Going for melee crit and melee damage. And uh, we're going to go for the, for the good options. Because in, in my offline playthrough, I'm doing like full-on sort of evil choices. Phase gate. Hmm. Have we been there? We did find one gate. I wonder if it's like the same one or something new we haven't seen. But yeah, they're level gated. You can tell, you know, the world is quite sparse. Sparse? Sparse. Which, for me, it's fine, honestly. I enjoy just kind of traveling around and looting some shit. <laughs> Killing some shit. It's pretty chill. Okay, 300 meters away. Might be a good idea to jump into the prawn. At this stage. Let's try that. Been holding off on watching any reviews and gameplay would rather just see the stream character and experience it from there yeah um it will be interesting i'm actually curious to see if you will like the game or not Corrido. it will be interesting to see man i think this is the way Just an average game so far, to be honest. Not bad, not extremely good. Yeah, uh, I will say the good stuff for me works a lot because, like I said, I, I find the character is very charming and uh, the combat so far seems fun. Not amazing. You know, the contact, especially for melee, is not great. But it's, it's enough that... I'm enjoying it a lot, so. There's Alan. Are you preparing to leave, Alan? Yes. There is much to do. Oh, he can teleport. Alan, come back. I was talking about Biomutant. Yeah, what's up, Timeless? How are you, man? Do you still wish to leave with me? Beyond this teleporter, there is no turning back. Are you Chop, kidding? what's up? I can't pass up a chance to see where Architect's coming from. Besides, I don't have another ride. I do not know what we will find there. 
The others may be sick or angry if they live at all. Or you could find peace. Family. I hope you are right. Family. Please complete any business you still have on this planet. Join me on the other side when you are ready to leave. Bro, I'm fucking ready to go, man. I've packed all my bags. Whoa! Shit! Robin, you're just in time. The phase gate is opening. You've been hiding a phase gate here this whole time? Only for the last millennium. It will lead us home. No wonder you hid yourself from Altera. It was imperative to keep the homeworld safe, in hopes that the others survived. Yeah. Yeah, I would agree, Timeless. I'm having fun with it, though. Will you help me prepare the ship? The energy masks must be moved into place. Oh. Well, this is different. Let's go. Woo! Alien sex hands. Let's go. Chop, yeah, we were talking about Biomutant. Fuck the clumsy human. Turn to me and I will initiate ship assembly. Ship assembly, dude. Do it. Thank you. The masts are in place. Do me now, the Alan. The field is ready. There is no time to lose. <laughs> wow. That's what she said. Can I get in? Johnny likes his robots. <laughs> I apologize. The levitator was calibrated for heavier bodies. We're not fat enough. I would have helped you to your feet, but as you can see, I have been fully integrated with the ship. Is this permanent? Nothing is permanent. Are you ready to go? Yeah, you could say that. Ready to leave the past behind. Good. Please brace yourself and then we will depart. Brace where, dude? You have no furniture. <laughs> okay. Here. Brace. Just lay down flat. In three, two, one. <laughs> Role play as a rug? Shit. Like being stepped on and stuff? Whoa. 
that does have its market, as we've seen recently. Wow. <gasps> I could probably roleplay as a rug. Okay, Scylla, come on. Some people would pay for what that feature. When we get there? If I am the last of my kind, I will experience the sorrow of 10,000 souls dimly. <gasps> okay, that's fine. Oh. Oh. Robot Gana Sudoku? Dude, their city! And if they survived? With you, I am ready to face whatever awaits. Ah, a romantic. Now you're you're not gonna end me like this, right? Ah, come on, man. Show me some of the alien city, bro. Oh, you finish me like this? Oh, Jesus. Second expansion. Let's get some music in the background. Jesus. Subnautica second expansion. <laughs> Blue balled by the ending. Yeah, well, I thought we were gonna get to see some of the city, you know? God damn it. Okay, well, there really wasn't a lot left of the game, huh? <laughs> we're gonna have time to start our uh, Biomutant character, I think, for a bit. So, quick thoughts on the game. It's a good, it's a solid game. However... However, guys. It's not as good as the first one, I'm sad to say. It's not as good as the first one. Vehicles are markedly worse, in my opinion. There are several times where you kind of feel stupid because you don't know where to go and you, you just have to like roam aimlessly until you find something. There have been like several unfortunate times when I also happen to miss like a blueprint or something like that and then that caused me to like slow down my progression a lot. So for some reason, the first one felt a lot more streamlined. Like things just flowed a lot better. I don't know. That's uh, kind of my experience with it. I'm curious now to read up on like what what some other people think because it's it's pretty solid for the price. I think it was like 15 bucks. It's great, right? It's really good. Good, solid base building, cool exploration, good music. The land portions were not on par. Land portions were a bit iffy. Um, you know, at least they had like a Leviathan monster on the surface, like a warm thing that shows up. That was cool. And um, the centipede Leviathan was also pretty dope as a design, but could have used more Leviathans in my opinion more biomes it wasn't a full price no no for the price it's a great game it's a great game i just i don't think it's on par with the first one but you know that's just my opinion still very much worth playing for sure for sure <laughs>